all yes <laughs> there's a possibility that you didn't understand that lawsuit now <laughs> here's how you get sued pooch when you arrest somebody for the accusation of a crime yes and you don't wait for the jury's verdict <laughs> and you reissue a protection order that violated my custody while i was going through the critical stages of the proceedings against myself yes you abused your power pope the protection order, yes, was enforceable during the whole judicial proceedings, <laughs> and if it had lasted longer than that, yes, it still would have been in place, pooch. But when you abused your power, you're getting sued, ooch, for putting me involved, involving me in additional proceedings that were completely unnecessary. <laughs> now, it's stressful enough being the accused, yes. <laughs> There's a lot of emotional trauma that goes on with that. Ooh. And the thought of my my wife being there in 2012 <laughs> after she filed for dissolution of marriage while on the witness stand. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Without me uh, being... Oh. <laughs> then there's present at all critical stages of the proceedings against him. Ooh. <laughs> Now, when uh, the public defender's office mentioned that I wanted to reschedule my mental health evaluation, and <laughs> you decided to request my presence in court. I wasn't at that court proceeding, coach. I mentioned that lawsuit. Yes. <laughs> well, it was sure a brainstorm on your part to decide to mention my name during any judicial proceeding. <laughs> Where I myself, as the accused, was not in Squim, Washington? Yes! And I was accused of violating a fraudulent protection order where I myself, as the accused, was not given any reasonable notice of court hearings. I was not given actual notice of court hearings. Pooch! You had court hearings 40 days after you issued the temporary protection order. When you consider this, well, you can't mention the name of any of the accused in any court proceeding without the accused being there. Pooch. Now you can summons me to appear in court for any fucking reason you want. Yes. You could say I'd like to see his face. He's the accused. I just want to make sure he's doing what his personal recognizance allows. And as a judge, as long as you give me timely, yes, accurate, oh, and mandatory notice so that I can arrange my schedule to appear in court, yes, to explain anything you want to know about me. You just put it on the docket, right. You send me notice. As a homeless man, where did it go? Pouch! Well, it went to 1023 Kitchen Dick Road. Ouch! Now, I would say that Mike Van Proying have a knowledge of any and all notices of court hearings. Yes. Mm -hmm. After having texted me that if I contact Mike or Marilyn, it would be harassment or trespassing. Yes. He would contact the authorities if I ever tried to contact him. I would say that he's guilty of violating my rights as the accused to have notice of all court proceedings against me. Yes. Now, he never contacted you, did he? Poo. How are you doing today? Good morning to you. Good morning. He never told the court, well, Paul doesn't live here and we keep getting his mail. Poe, he needs to, the court needs to stop sending letters of of being the accused of court hearings. Pow, 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 pow. Mike decided to totally fuck me over and you let him go to England, did you? Pooch! You let him go to Africa. Pow! You let him go to Washington, D.C. Ouch! You let him go to Israel. Pow! He's been traveling throughout the whole world knowing that if I ever called him, yes, I ever went to that actual uh, location, yes, that he'd call the cops and I'd get arrested for trespassing or harassment. Pooch! And instead of informing the court that that Paul does not live here. Ouch! 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 You decided to allow Mike to be very involved in the fraud of violating my rights as the accused, uh, to be involved in all the critical stages of every court proceeding for the last fucking five fucking years! <laughs>